Good morning, everyone. It is Friday. Love Fridays. Um, usually like them more when I'm working a steady job, but you know, it's still the weekend's here or about to be here. So Friday is always a, uh, a great day. Uh, I'm on my way to my aunt's right now to help move that uh, move her dining room table. Uh, she had her carpets cleaned, and uh, from there I'm going to the gym. And today is um, today is really nice outside. Finally. Uh, 60s, uh, nice temperature. Um, polar vortex is gone. Woo! And then tonight, I'm gonna be heading to my friend Derek's house. Yes, one of my, my best, one of my best friends from high school. My two best friends from high school names are Derek and Eric. Um, my usual Friday night routine since I've been home is to go by Derek's house and we just hang out, and have a few drinks, and hang out, and play uh, usually uh, yard games like ring toss and beanbags and stuff like that. Um, you know, just something to do. It's different. It doesn't cost a lot of money. I got a little sidetracked when I noticed that uh, my brother's dog didn't all out poop in the house, but did uh, somehow manage to get a little bit um, on the floor, which I didn't notice till after I stepped in it and tracked it all over the, my carpet. So, uh, thankfully though, my friend CJ, she got, uh, back when the girls were puppies, got us a, uh, a handheld carpet steamer, carpet cleaner, which this thing has been a lifesaver for years now. Um, and I haven't really used it all that much for the girls unless they happen to puke because they, they don't go in the house, thankfully. Um, in fact, I think I've used it more lately just for cleaning up my own spills. Every time I spill a, a glass of wine or something, you know, something falls on the floor. Um, but it's been handy since I've been back because my brother's dog tends to... Uh, uh, make a mess every now and then. Um, <coughs> although I don't think this was this wasn't an all out. I'm just gonna poop in the house. This was either he had something sat down or I, I, I mean I don't know, but it wasn't like full on like disgusting. It was just you know stepped in a small bit and happened to track it all over the place, uh, which makes it interesting. Like I wonder, wonder like if you were had something like that could track to see where you walk throughout your house or throughout your day. I think that'd be kind of cool. If you had like this, you know, you're able to die, put like die on the bottom of your shoes and see like where you walked and where your high traffic areas were in your house. Because that is one like little cool thing about that little fiasco this morning was just saying, okay, well, I walked here and then I came here and kind of like re retracing your steps. So, yeah, I mean, it's still gross to have to clean it, but I mean, if you got the tools and you're prepared for it, not a huge deal. And thankfully, uh, CJ was enough to think ahead for us and be like you guys are gonna need this and um, and sure enough we did and that thing has been the, the perfect gift that's been been used and used and used you know nothing beats a nothing beats a thoughtful gift so CJ thank you um, because your gift with that copy cleaner has been a lifesaver time and time again also another cool thing it's been uh, love waking up in the morning and looking into the mirror and like just starting to see um, starting to see the weight loss. It's like a few things cheer me up more in the morning than than seeing that. It's like, all right, I'm working towards a goal. I've got dog hair in my face. Um, <laughs> no, but a few things cheer me up more in the morning than you know, working towards a goal and seeing seeing the results of the work you're putting into something actually taking shape and coming to fruition. It's just absolutely awesome. I love seeing it. You know, and it's not just with that, but with anything. You, know, you set out to do something and you know see progress, track progress, and then achieve you know, the end result of the goal. It's just you know, nothing feels better. So yeah, I'm in a great mood today. Leaving my aunt's, and it actually didn't involve as much as I thought it was going to. She got her carpet cleaned, and um, all they just needed was help moving the table three inches to get the little pads they put under the table legs out, and. Um, and she got a new TV for her room, and so the TV she was using was this like 13-inch small little thing from like 1970 something. I'm surprised it had a cable, coaxial cable thing in the back. And she got a little flat panel. And um, the toughest part about that was just uh, figuring out how to get the basic. Comcast cable remote to turn the TV on and off, but thankfully, um, Comcast website actually does a really good job with having, uh, you know, a little programming thing and it's like choose your remote.
remote, choose your TV, do this, enter this code, and boom, you know, five minutes. Um, but yeah, it just, you know, another case of people who don't keep up with technology struggling with it, and I, it just amazes me that, that that's the case. Because you, I don't know, I just, I do everything I can to make sure that I'm not falling behind with knowing how to use stuff, and uh, see so many times, you know, just going back to my grandmother not being able to operate the VCR to now, like, my mother having trouble with computers and email, and um, it's kind of, it's kind of comical, you know, it's almost, it's like the inverse of those, uh, you know, kids react to, like, 70s technology, it's like, you know, old people react to new technology, it's kind of funny sometimes to see how, to see the mentalities, but, uh, yeah, I just, one thing I don't ever want to lose touch with is what's new and new technology-wise, because that just, uh, anyway, I'm rambling, off to the gym. So, the reason I love cell phone cases, I had a little klutzy moment, because I normally keep my, my iPhone here on this little uh, dash mount while, uh, while I'm driving, and then use it for GPS, and this is what I use when I'm recording video, and taking it off, and it went, whoop, and then out and onto the pavement, I don't know if you can see, I've got some nice little jings there, thankfully though, those are on the case, and not the phone, so Apple, good job with this uh, case, um, that really would have sucked too, because... Um, I got this phone, I got this phone here, this is, um, new like a week ago because my old iPhone 5 had an issue with the, the charger cable, so thankfully it's working, and it's still working thanks to the case, so thank you Apple for making a good case. just left the gym and I am on my way home and it is just the perfect day, like it's finally nice enough out to be able to drive with the windows down, and sorry if there's a lot of background noise, I haven't exactly done that much, like, with the windows down, so I don't know how this is even going to turn out. But, um, yeah, and other random side note, like, my sinuses for the first time in forever are, like, clear. Like, I can, I'm not congested at all, which is surprising considering allergy season starting. I've got trees blooming stuff, and after cleaning out my parents' basement earlier this week, all that dust and crap, and for some reason, I'm not complaining, I'm ecstatic about this. I can breathe out any problem right now. And someone in their Camaro is being cool. I wish there was a way to get smells to come through these videos. But anyway, I'm making lunch, and um, if you've never cooked with coconut oil before, you really should. Um, it's got the same nutritional value as uh, extra virgin olive oil. I'm going to get virgin coconut oil. Um, and in this case, I'm making chicken. And what I have going on here is it's uh, chicken breast and I put some chipotle chili powder on it and a little bit of salt and the the, uh, the sweetness in the coconut oil offsets the heat in the chili with chili powder and it just tastes so good and then I'm also steaming some brussels sprouts and uh, I know some of you are probably like Ugh, brussels sprouts well that's fine more for me because I like them and this one likes them too which is why she's sitting here and just meandering about waiting for me to drop something. Right, Hoppy? Here's what it looks like when it's all cooked up and done, and it is so good. So I got a haircut, finally. That's all said and done. And now I am off with the girls. We are going to go to Fort Tabor, which is um, near the beach, for a walk. Um, <clears throat> but before that, I'm going to get gas. So. It's such a nice day outside. It really is perfect. Um, you know, why leave them in the house all day? Let's get them outside of the house and let them run around a little bit. It's, um, it's one of the things I kind of miss about living um, in an apartment is that, yeah, the yard's nice, but it can, it can get me sometimes to be a little lazy with getting out and... Uh, taking the girls for a walk because it's just so easy to open the back door and let them out to do their business. So it's nice to get out every now and then and uh, get, them out, get them out of the house, get me out of the house, go for a walk, spend some time with them and you know, share a little, a little away time for all of us. And made a stop. Yes, I'm cheating, but this is so good. It's um, orange pineapple ice cream. So orange 
essentially orange ice cream with chunks of pineapple and it was so good if you only place I've been able to find it's around here I don't know when I lived out on the west coast could never find any place that had it so it'd be nice to find in other places or figure out how to get this at home because it's so good purple shutters purple cop I think this person likes purple so we decided to come to the park instead of going down to Fort Tabor because by the ocean it's extremely windy so this is a, uh, a little warmer answer and they've already been making friends I think we've been stopped by about six people already who wanted to say hi and pet them so it's always good And they are all kinds of excited. And yes, they love coming to the park or just going on walks in general. Hoppy, what you doing? And I am all wrapped up. This Wiggles here loves to look out. So I'm here at my friend Derek's house, and there's Eric. Hey. And there's Jay. Yeah. And Derek, Derek's upstairs taking a... Anyway, he's upstairs. Uh, so we're just we're playing this game called Heads Up, um, which I'll show you some videos to. Um, some some excerpts from some of the videos but yeah that's our night right now and then we're gonna do some ring toss later and back from upstairs there's Derek the other Derek hi the shorter the Derek. Italian stallion yeah, anyway <laughs> <laughs> all right so yeah we're gonna go play some more well, uh, of manly beer right now turn around so oh, okay. drinking. drinking the same thing oh no I'm not I'm Johnny Apple IPA. Uh, indeed there's a little bit of Johnny in every sip <laughs> That's he, why he's he, drinking it. Yeah, he drinks it for the seed. Um, <laughs> oh, Jesus. He drinks it for Johnny. He does it for Johnny. <laughs> oh my. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go. Guys, the outside. Oh no. We're gonna go. <laughs> John, come on. We're gonna go back to playing uh, some more heads up, um, up and Johnny. I'll clip some videos in from that here so everyone can see. <laughs> I set the bar low for you guys. So. <laughs> Um, all right, uh, Star was, Wars, yeah. Play Queen Amidala. I don't know Star Wars. Pass it. Um, Jailhouse Rock. Elvis. Yes. yes. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> no. Yeah, no. Fuck you. Yeah. Um, yeah. Drag Queen. Uh, yes. RuPaul. Yes. <laughs> um, uh, General, um, Secretary of State under George Bush, black guy. Black guy. Um, Army General, no. Um, the leader of, leader of Cuba. Cuba. Yeah. I don't know. Really? I don't know. Cuba. Oh, he died. I'm sorry. Um, oh. oh. <laughs> he can't he, he didn't die. I thought he died. No. What yeah, is this? No, his brother's brought in it now. Yeah, but he's, he's still alive. The oh, diary no. of... A wimpy kid. No. <laughs> <laughs> little girl, little girl, no, no, Nazi, no. Germany. 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 Little Germany. Nazi Germany, Little Germany, Nazi Germany, you know, oh, come on, you <laughs> oh, come on, man, oh, man, uh, being, 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 yeah, being somebody, yeah, 
Damn hey, hey, prank, really? <laughs> Okay, um, Philip vodka says. and orange juice. Philip uh, said, oh, Johnny, yep. yep. Okay, um, you know, into this where they tie, tie you up and bondage. have sex. Yes. yes. All right. Um, okay, we're gonna drink. This. I get these in the fridge. You know, you make some. You go like this, your finger. In Shooters. It. Oh, Jello shots. Yes. yes. Um, this position where you just lay back and you take it. Spread so, eagle. Someone's humping him from the front. Yep. A missionary. Yes. yes. <laughs> I uh. Ellie like gives with the open booty. Baby okay, got back? Yes. <laughs> um, all right, I got these. They're breasts. They're fake. Oh, uh, implants. Yes. I, um, not HBO, but... Cinemax. Yes. yes. Okay, um, and I like... And getting caught in, in the, the rain. rain. Um, pina colada. Yes. <laughs> all right, um, all right, I'm going to drop the... Bomb. Yep, and I find these on the beach. Shell, sand. Put yes, together. you got it. Put them together. Uh, bombshell. Yes. Yeah. All right. Um, oh, I take, take this. Pill, get the phone out. The blue pill. Oh, it's the Alice. It's my Yes. 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 Um, okay. That. Man, this is oh, when you get a you thingy get a... down here. <laughs> like, shh. girls do it. Yeah. Brazilian wax. Yes. yes. <laughs> hey, so I'm home now, and um, had a good evening. It was a lot of fun, as usual, hanging out with Derek and Eric and, uh, and Jay. So, um, yeah, oh, one thing I forgot to mention earlier is uh, digging through the, uh, the vacuum bags of old clothes. I didn't even realize, but um, some stuff is now fitting me that hasn't fit me in years, but some stuff even that hasn't fit me in a while, like this shirt, is actually kind of kind of too big. I mean, I've got all this fold over and such, so... Yeah, I guess I should have went through those bags. Uh, should have went through those bags sooner. But uh, yeah, so I'm home and and it's late. So I'm going to bed. So uh, thank you for watching. I uh, hope you had a great day. And um, if you like this video, please click like and uh, leave comments and seriously about the comments anything you think I could be doing differently better issues with editing I don't care I'm still new at this still learning so I'm not gonna get offended by any comments but please leave anything and subscribe subscribe please subscribe have your friends subscribe I want lots of subscribers um, yes would love to have tons of people watching this and if you are watching this thank you I appreciate the fact that you care enough to actually subscribe to my channel and give a crap about what's going on in my life. It um, actually, it, it really does mean something to me and I appreciate it. So thank you and have a great night and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh,